to plan the research study uh, in your own area, design the research project, and be able to conduct research. Apparently, we have no choice. All of us will be expected to do our own research. So, I would uh, encourage you to make sure that uh, we are together in our discussions. Uh, we don't lose one another. When the board is going towards Karonga, nobody should be found going to Monkey Bay. Right? If you find yourself going to Monkey Bay, raise your flag and say, ah, I'm going in the wrong direction. Because this, this course is a very crucial course for you to get your BSC. You can't get the BSC or whether it's a BA without having skills in this. So let us make sure that we are in the same boat. So uh, in terms of the course that we are going to be having, this is briefly what we are going to be looking at. The course outline, as I'll be saying again, will show you the various topics that we'll be covering over the semester. I'm going to promise to bring an adapter for my book so that you can make this. I am in this minutes. You see that? <coughs> he was taking all his time. But now, uh, that was just a, an, an introductory remark for the boss. I want to get into business. In terms of this lecture today, We want to concentrate this guy on the definitions of various technologies, uh, definitions of the uh, concept, constructs in the research, uh, as well as to try to understand what we mean by research, what is the role of research. Uh, in the development, why do that is research? In my slide here, I'm saying in human resources management, but you know, human resources management in all of it. Okay? Yeah, I'll say, I'll come to slide later on to her and we'll get it. Since she's not coming here, at least you should have this slide later on. Just be sure you have an email address as well. Yeah. Put it there as well. Who else has an email address? Everyone. Just there. Yeah. Here's our little screen. Okay. 
I am wish to lose my true colleagues. You are not wrong, you are right, but we are only talking about part of the message. Uh, he seems to be more uh, uh, comprehensive. Uh, she was going in the same direction of all, so she has been too brief. It's the process of generating knowledge. Thank you. 
arises, you know how to deal with this because those people have taught you how to do things. They did it in traditional culture. They praised the minister when they declare this is the way we are going to be doing things. They, you know that they, I have to do it that way. If I don't do it that way, there are some processes, right? So that's the source of knowledge as well. Uh, but the, here we are referring to situations where, although we, are, we have all those sources of knowledge, we do these situations where something has occurred. We don't know how to deal with it, and we need to know how we can deal with that situation. Uh, so,
theories about it, autocratic leadership, democratic leadership, and so on and so forth. Which is, as I've just said, autocratic, you have already started thinking, and this one is a very difficult place for uh, He's a dictator. Uh, democratic, the oldest one is the, the more friendly person you can deal with. In each case, there are goals <coughs> and cons, advantages and disadvantages, which are uh, generally accepted in theory in, in human resources. We can talk about the same theories in community development, development, for example, what is development? There are generally accepted ideas as, as to what development means, what a community means. Um, so, when you are conducting the research, that research can actually contribute to what such theories. The guy who came up with it, Ohm's law, did not just come up with that. He conducted the research, tried various materials, pushing in uh, electrons, and so that it creates you can create electricity. And in his process, or in her process, it's able to identify that if you, if you are doing it with the wood, yes, you generate electricity, but no, it's not very efficient. Wood is less effective. If you do it in metal, yes, it does it well in metal. This specific type of metal is much better than that. And that's why they came up with all these gadgets. Uh, they have specific materials to use was They did those. Experiments. So, apart from um, generating information to solve your problems, it can also be used for uh, coming up with theories in your own area of specialization. And as you are coming up with theories in your area of specialization, you will be contributing to the development of that area of specialization. You become a person very wrong in that area. Because of we are talking of homes, but that was a person, eh? and all of us talk about that person. Because it was a giant in that area. Research can also help in generating information for developing hypotheses for testing. Uh, 
going out in the field and they're throwing themselves down. And when they throw themselves down, they eat a fast. So the eggs come. In the process, the mother dies, but that's when how they generate produce themselves. <laughs> and that was the hypothesis. What was, why did they go into hypothesis? People thought that's the way aminos were produced. But they had not yet verified whether it is correct or not. Now, in the research, you take those hypotheses and you test them to see whether it's true or not true. So, research can also be used for genetic information to deal with such hypotheses. How can you use research in your display? Now you can hear that the issue about it, uh, uh, information uh, to deal with problems in your area. What are the ways? Yes, madam. Yes, so. What's the question again? How do you use the research in your display? How do you use the research? I might have pushed the new by using the new display. No, I got it. How do I do this? Why? Okay, put it in, a, in, in another simple way. Why would I do this? Because I can do this. Find solutions, but that one you told me already. I expected that. I wanted you to tell me other reasons why. Five minutes to stretch our legs. 